Check it out, bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we have a Mega Crab announcement to make. So, we did a little bit of math here, and based on the fact that there's 12 days, um, 11 days by the time this video comes out, I think, uh, something like that, I don't know. Um, so based on the fact that it says there's 12 days now, it is, uh, it is guaranteed that these are going to be the tribes that we have for Mega Crab, because these tribes will leave on the 28th. And the Mega Crab, we were told, comes every week, every, every single last weekend. Okay, chicken words, come on, figure it out. Uh, the last weekend of every month. That's a more proper way to say it, guys. But, uh, but yeah, so these are guaranteed to be the tribes that we have for uh, the Mega Crab. Now, this is exciting because these are excellent tribes. Now, aside from the Cryonier damage, that's not going to be very useful. The gunboat energy gain in itself is going to be a massive game changer because, uh, mainly because on the Mega Crab, you're not always using smoky attacks. Now, the gunboat energy gain is is great for PvP and stuff, but it's not huge for um, operations because you're not doing operations in kind of a spread out way um, where you're collecting a bunch of stuff. Um, you're you're just kind of smoking right up to the core. Oh, come on, guys, stop doing with the gimme attacks. Um, okay, we'll show Marty's hit here. On, uh, on Waterloo. But yeah, I mean, for hits like this on the Mega Crab, it's not going to be um, beneficial at all. But if you do find yourself using things like uh, Scorcher Tank, Rifle Crowd Zuka Medic, um, spread out all the heavies, I'm sure that'll come into effect for at least the chicken. Um, it's going to be fantastic. It's going to be huge. It's going to be a, a massive game changer. So uh, very excited to see that. Let's check this out. Marty with another just perfectly timed robotic almost uh, with those shocks, guys. Look at this. He gets right up on the HQ. He does some pretty good damage there. Uh, he gets another round of shocks off and then the... Uh, oh, man. So, big shout out to Marty and Red and uh, John, a.k.a. Dutch, a.k.a. Duck. The other Red, all the guys holding down the Chicken Coop 5. We are slowly making a comeback to, um, to where we were. I mean... Uh, we got to number 13 and now we're just kind of taking a break um, But we'll get right back into it. We're still top 100. We'll be top 50 after um, After the end of this operation in a couple hours here for sure. So uh, Yeah, so that's what we want to say about the crab and the tribes guys. I can't wait. I'm very excited It's gonna be fantastic and let's go ahead and dive on into today's war factor and see what we can or can't get done So we have a 2 million shield. I see a lot of grapplers. I see a lot of doom cannons. I see a lot of lasers this one actually looks pretty gross. So what uh, what tribes do we have to work with here? We just have the heavy speed, eh? Well, let's see if we can do an all heavy rush, guys. I know that's what everyone is uh, has come out to see. So uh, what do we got to do to make this work, chicken? Let's go with a uh, hmm. Let's hack right here, and next we'll hack a doom cannon uh, right over there. And we can actually just use the hacks to just kind of take out specific things that we want to take out. Um, and then get the heavies kind of going from there. So we'll go like this, and like that, and then like this. And we'll throw all those guys right about there. Then we'll go in with all the heavies just like this, guys. And we don't have to be too worried about smoking them. I mean, the grapplers are going to kind of pull them right off to the sides anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, we, we do want to make sure that we're smoking brick, though. So we'll go like this, and we'll go bang, bang, bang. Just like that, and then we'll flare right on the HQ. Okay, we did lose brick, so we can't lose brick when we're actually doing this properly, guys. That's gonna be um, that's gonna be a big no-no. So we'll go ahead and we'll throw a shock right down. We want to hit as many of these cannons basically as we can get. Um, hmm. Okay, so even with the heavy speed, they're not really doing much for damage, especially with all these lasers just ripping them apart. So uh, let's let's call an audible and let's go ahead and take down the shield gens first. Now. Apparently, you can't actually hack a shield generator, so let's go ahead and try that theory on the next attack uh, with the all heavies, because we said we were doing this against War Factory for some reason. That's a good idea, chicken. Uh, good thing that attack didn't go through. Alright, we're all over the place, guys, but that's fine. So let's see. Let's test this theory. I'm pretty sure you cannot do this. Uh, yeah, okay, so we just wasted 10 GB there. It looked like it actually did some damage, though, weirdly enough, unless that was already there. I guess it was already there. Uh, okay, so what else do we got to work on, chicken? Let's take out... Uh, this Doom Cannon. Let's take out that guy, and I don't want to waste any more GB for now. So let's uh, let's see if we can or cannot uh, get some of these shields down. So we'll go, we'll flare them up like this. Oh man, this is not going to go well, is it? Okay, we'll go up like this. And the problem is here, 
is their movement speed. And we also, um, we also lost a smoke there somehow. Uh, okay, so let's go like this. And let's do a critter shock right about here. Bang, bang, bang. Then we'll get some health packs going out like that. Oh, man. Okay, so we might have to swap the heavies out for some Zookas. I don't want to throw in the towel just yet, only on attack number two, guys. But it's not looking good. It's really not looking good. I mean, at this point, we're going to be sooner off to just use Gunboat Energy to take down the shields. Uh, I assume we were going to get a little bit more work done than that. But, uh, okay, so attack number three. We're sticking with the all heavies. One, two, three. One, two, three. Is that going to be enough? Uh, looks like it's not. And then we'll go like this. One, two. Uh, okay, one more. And we'll get at least one shield there. Okay, we'll take the rest out on the next one. And then let's just use the rest of the heavies to just get some, some sort of work done here. Uh, okay, we'll shock there. We'll get a brick battle orders going out like that um okay so next up let's uh let's just go ahead and finish off the shield gens while we can and we'll get another battle orders going off like this and okay we're gonna have to do a little bit more precisely with the sh with the artillery on the shields okay boom all right so we got the shields down guys um let's go ahead let's hack this doom cannon not to get the doom cannon off of us but so it starts taking out other defenses that's what we want to see right there by that doom cannon I don't want anything to take it down. I just want it to start sniping the other defenses for me. Which it looks like it's doing a very good job of doing. So thank you, uh, Doom Cannon. Um, okay, so next we're going to have to go like this. Let's throw a bunch of critters on that guy. Um, okay, so we're doing okay here, guys. We're doing okay. That Doom Cannon still is going to have to go down here. Uh, let's get a shock one off right about there. And let's actually flare all the heavies right on over to it. I want to get that guy down because he's going uh, he's gonna to be causing us some problems in it here in a minute. So... Uh, we're doing what we can. Now, next up, let's hack uh, this Doom Cannon. And hopefully we can get the same effect. We'll get it to start shooting some other stuff. Um, and maybe we can even save up enough GBE to get another hack going. Because we have the gun, the uh, Gunboat Energy regaining stuff going uh, right now. So we got to make sure we're staying on top of that. And, okay, so that's going to be it for attack number... Was this four? I mean, for... Like... We got a chance, guys. We got a chance. Oh, we got two hits left? Pfft, easy. It's too easy for all heavy, guys. It's way too easy. Um, okay. So, first off, I want to get rid of... Uh, I want to finish you off. And I want to get rid of this guy. And then I think we're just going to core rush and see if uh, anything else is going to cause us some problems. So, let's go ahead and get all the heavies going out right here. Get those grapplers distracted by the heavies because they're not really going to be doing anything. They're just going to pull them a little bit closer, which is fine. Um, okay, so let's uh, let's get some hacks going off over here. And, okay, so let's get a battle orders going off this way. I want to take that grappler down, then we're going to reflare. Um, okay, let's actually take down a couple of these sniper towers as well. Uh, I got a little bit too close to that hot pot, but I think that's fine. Uh, then we'll go like this and like this. Oh man, we got way too close to that hot pot. Uh, okay, so we'll get a hack going there. And let's get another hack going right about here. I want to get that laser down out of the way. And we'll go one, two, three artilleries and the attack spine. So, I was feeling pretty good before. Now not so much. Now not so much, guys. Uh, okay, so what do we got left in the HQ? We got uh, 1.9. Uh, are these grapplers in range? Ooh, yes they are. Uh, okay, so what we're gonna do here we're just gonna clear everything and let's hack let's hack uh, let's hack this cannon because I don't think we want to get them that far we'll hack that cannon and we'll hack this grappler I think I think that's the correct play and then we'll just go with everything else we'll just go from there and I think we can make that work uh, okay, we'll help out all the stuff there with that grappler. Um, okay, so I'm going to go like that. I'm going to flare them back. I'm going to shock right here. And, okay, yeah, so those lasers are going to be an issue. If I could get them focused on something else, that would be nice. But um, I think we got to make do here. So let's get a battle wars going off like that. And they're going to get everybody kind of loaded up. And now let's, let's flare onto the HQ, I think. We got 100 GB left, so let's go with... Uh, let's splash a couple of health kits down. Let's get a battle orders off. Uh, okay, so I'm going to have to save this for another battle orders, I think, guys. Uh, and then we'll just kind of make do from there. 
Uh, okay, so we'll get another Battle Lords going off like this. Now, what's causing us the most immediate damage? I think it's these three lasers right here, guys. Look at this. Look at this. We got a chance. War Factory against all heavies. An unconventional strategy. I don't know if I'd recommend it. I don't know if we're even going to take it down yet. We're losing heavies left and right here. Come on. Boom. War Factory goes down. Back, back, back. So, guys, there it is. There's War Factory with the all heavies. There's the Mega Crab Tribes being announced. Ah, uh, man. Yeah, that was good. That was good. I, I wasn't sure about it. I wasn't sure. I, th I thought by attack, uh, by the time attack 3 was over, I thought we were done, guys. I thought we were done. done. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. That is going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you next one, guys. Check it out. Bye, bye, bye.